Hey, this is Andy with Pale Spruce, and I want to take you through the contents of the Stay Out There kit just to show you everything that's, that's inside of the kit. So bear with me for a second. I'll zoom in here and get to the details. Alright, so here we are, and first I just want to get a quick weight on the total kit. And right now this kit is packaged with the, um, with the Survival Kit add-on. So both of those together come in at a total of 11.8 ounces. And if I take out the Survival Kit and just weigh the kit, the, the Stay Out There kit by itself, it's 8.65. And this is the kit that's intended for use on overnight bike biking trips, bike touring, um, anything with overnight. So you first just got the, the pouch. It's the same material that uh, you get with grocery bags. And then inside of the pouch, everything's packaged into a 9x6 lock sack bag. It's waterproof, dustproof, and seals up real nice. And then inside of the bag, so we'll just turn this over here. Um, first thing here is a ID card, so your contact information. You can just put all of your contact information there. And uh, we also have two single use packets of Friction Freedom chamois cream. And these packets, you can actually get two days per packet. So you've got really four days of riding with these packets. And then since we're an overnight trip, can't go without your toilet paper. So there's two packages um, of toilet paper wrapped up. And there's two of those. And again, because we're talking about overnight, uh, there's Maybe a uh, toothbrush, just a simple travel toothbrush, and a tube of travel toothpaste gets packaged into this little holder just to, so the edges don't poke through the a lock sack, just a little protective covering. And then there is also um, a one ounce tube of sunscreen and then for the, all the other pieces I'm just going to pull all of these out um, we'll go through them so the first one here this is just in a little ziploc bag this is going to be all of your band-aids and um, gauze that, that come in the kit so we'll Pull all of that out. So inside of that little bag, there's actually two packets of gauze pads. These are two inch by two inch, and each of these packets has two gauze pads in it, so you get a total of four. And there's two Natropel wipes. These are just deep free uh, bug wipes. And then you've got five standard band-aids there are four butterfly bandages two uh, knuckle bandages and then two of these um, band-aid they're actually blister uh, bandages they, they work really well I tried them out and they got a really good adhesive on there and it helps um, with blisters and they'll stay on for for several days so that's all the bandages and gauze pads let me move on to all the medicines um, I'm going to pull them out so you don't get all the rustling noise. We'll start here with 
four packets of ibuprofen. Each of these packets has two tablets. So you get a total of eight tablets. You've got two packets of electrolyte tablets as just emergency electrolytes. And we've got four packets of triple antibiotic uh, to put onto uh, a cut. And then two packets of antacids. There's, there's two tablets in each one of these packets. And then there are four uh, antihistamine tablets. So if you have an allergic reaction to bees or, or anything else. And then finally, um, down here at the bottom, four uh, antiseptic towelettes. Again, just to, to clean a wound or a, a blister, get it nice and clean before you bandage it up. So that's all the medicines. And then the last piece here is this final small Ziploc. And inside here, a few different things. There's a small uh, bullet type um, lip balm. There's a razor blade and it comes in a nice carrying case so it's it's protected. And you've got a little small LED light. Actually bright enough considering its size. And again that's just an emergency light. You've got two safety pins. And then inside of this, another Ziploc bag, is some uh, super glue. And it's packaged in a, another bag just in case it empties out or spills. Um, that's good for gear repair or even if you get a really bad cut, you can, if you're going to be out for a couple of days, you can just seal it up. And there is uh, 18 inches of duct tape. And then we've got three of these little micro towels. Put a couple of drops of water on there and they expand out to uh, about eight inches by 10 inches. Nice towel to, to clean up if you've got to do some work on your bike and get greasy or you could even use them as a really big gauze pad if you had a, a really bad cut. And then the last piece is just an emergency whistle. Uh, just a, it's an aluminum whistle and then that's that's everything in the standard kit so all of that that i've gone through so far is part of the standard kit and then i'm going to go through the uh, survival add-on which just has a few extra items in it so for the survival add-on it also comes in a lock sack bag it's a four inch by five inch a lock sack and it comes with tin Oops, 10 feet of paracord, just wrapped up nice and tight. A mini Bic lighter. And we've got four um, water purification tablets. Let me just pull this out. Got a little mini... Uh, button compass and then four of these tender quick fire starters you can just fluff up the edges and they catch a spark especially with the Bic catch a spark really easy they burn for about one to two minutes and are really good at helping start a fire and then the final piece is an emergency blanket that actually comes packaged in a really small uh, it's folded up really really small and um, just in case you could use it for emergency shelter or um, if you need it as a, as a blanket to keep you warm in, a, in an emergency. So that's everything for the uh, survival add-on. So all of this comes in as the stay out there kit and hope you stay, stay safe out there and happy riding. Thanks.